Jimmy and this is my YouTube channel Jimmy on the Spectrum and I'm from Love on the Spectrum. Hello I'm Sinead and I'm from Love on the Spectrum and I'll be joining Jimmy's channel today Jimmy on the Spectrum. Do you find the interview? Me. Yeah you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, the lights will they're pretty bright. They were very uncomfortable. Snow hates lights. Yes, they were like really big lights and they were really bright. Um, I guess I was I was nervous, but it, having Jimmy by my side, I feel less anxious. And I thought it was quite fun. All of the interviews I came across as cranky and also I corrected Sinead a couple times. Um, for the correction part, Sinead and I actually have an agreement where, you know, I, I'm allowed to correct her because she wants to improve herself as well, mm. but, you know, I don't do it because I want to be rude, I, I, I do it because I want to help her. And you know? I asked him to. I asked him to, Jimmy, to help me correct the, the, the right way to say words. Shit, um. I my nose. The interview for me was very hard. Uh, I was extremely anxious, probably more so than Sinead by like a hundred. Um, the interview went for like a couple hours, but you know, there was only like a couple, few, uh, not much usable footage. Um, some of the questions were very interesting. Yeah, so we said no to some of them, a lot of them actually. Um, but they did, we did talk about Our date, our first date, it was amazing. And uh, we did kiss on the first date and we held, held hands the whole time and my hand felt like it was going to fall off at times. It was quite uncomfortable. There was, a, there was a question asked in the interview where he asked whether we watched the movie <laughs> and I answered saying, basically, duh. Or what else are we supposed to do? It's a cinema. Um, you know, I didn't find out until after that what he was referring to was, you know, the like. <laughs> I seen the on movies. Did we kiss um, in no. the movies? And yeah. the answer is no, because it's a movie. <laughs> um, and a lot of people found that amusing, but the truth is, is. Um, like, what is he talking about? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and, you know. I only know because of a movie and they kiss in the movies, and that's the only reason I knew that I thought that's what he was on about, and I was right. Sinead and I were both on time to our date. Half an hour. Um, Sinead was a half an hour early, and so was I. Um, but I didn't go up to her until the exact time that the date was starting, and I was actually up on the stairs and I could see her at the cold rock but because it wasn't 12 o'clock yet I did not go down. Um, my support worker at the time, Kelly, asked me why I didn't go down this. I just said, or oh, simply because it's not 12 o'clock yet. In the show they asked about kissing. Um, kissing's actually, you know, it's a, kissing's actually okay. We love kissing. Ish. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Holding hands is pretty cool too. I think they made us say I love each... Um, they kind of like tried to stage I love you and I said I love Shanae. Um, that holds up, I still love her. I still love Jimmy. One of the questions was asked is whether intimate when whether we're intimate and I said intimate stuff is easy. That still holds up. Um, as a couple on the spectrum, it's, you know, we're pretty straight to the point. Um, that's all I'm going to say. And as for the other question, whether we consummated our relationship, it's a stupid question. I'm not answering it. <laughs> the pool part of the episode was annoying because none of the people that I was used to having there were there. Um, but with the power of Lemon Line of Bitters... You're um, right. I prevailed. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, the guy I 
the guy I played was was he's a he's a good player, but you know for some reason I was just really focused, and I did actually not I didn't actually miss a ball the whole night, well, especially in that game, and I ended up winning the whole thing. Sinead was very helpful, but she refuses to come to any of my pool call. No, she loves coming to Ow, pool. my hair. My hair? Yeah. Awesome. I need to tug her hair. The person that runs the pool comp, he is hey, awesome. Um, uh, he's actually very cool because he racks the balls in the same way every time, and he does the same things every time, and it's very comforting. And as soon as he came, it was also another reason why I was able to calm down. He's a good guy. Airport scene when we entered the Gold Coast was very tedious <laughs> for the director, Kian, made us do it. Thanks, Kian. What feels like 10 billion hundred times. It was more than that. So it was more than that, actually. A thousand. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, you know, it's all for the, all for the shot. Um. Sinead said stop walking so fast in this shot where... What was it? Walking towards the... To walking towards the beach. Yes. Um, that, that happens quite a lot. It does. See, I like to take direct routes everywhere I go, and I have long legs and I'm Very quite fast. tall. So, sometimes I drag Sinead, <laughs> and I've been told it looks really bad, but... It's not. No. It's actually... He's trying to help me keep up with him. <laughs> I'm not trying... I'm trying to... <laughs> I'm, I'm just trying... trying to go as fast as possible. Yeah, I know, because you like yeah. to walk fast. Gotta go fast. Go, go, go. But, um, it is completely okay with Sinead. Um, yes. And if anything, good cardio. The scenes they use for um, trailers was me running full speed to the beat at a wave and then tripping over and falling on my face um that's actually something i do every time every time i go to the beach i pretty much sprint directly towards the beach and um you know land f i have no idea why i do it every um, time but it's pretty consistent here goes jimmy Woo. see you later um i'm gonna call out shanae in this one uh, she actually doesn't really care about views. <laughs> <laughs> um, so when she was at all at the Gold Coast view, you know, I don't know how true that actually was. <laughs> um, I was just shocked we got out because that door kept us at bay for so long. <laughs> <laughs> that's scary. <laughs> but yeah, I, I'm... I protect Sinead and that's why I grabbed Why'd her and I, I made sure she didn't fall over. Yeah, you never because know. Because she's incredibly clumsy and I, I was not going to dive like Superman and catch her like Lois because then we'd have three equal Sinead pieces. <laughs> Navy socks. Navy socks. Um, I was really anxious about asking Sinead to marry me because I didn't have Navy socks <laughs> and it was going on live TV and I suck at singing. And people ask me if I knew anything about it. I have no idea that he was going to propose to me. Oh yeah, she was no idea. borderline clueless. clueless. Yeah. I could have, I got down on my knee and she didn't know until I got the ring out. <laughs> <laughs> like I could... <laughs> Someone literally said, you know, contextually, Sinead did not see it coming at all. Nope. Um, there was actually a whole part where we were on the stairs waiting to go up. And I wanted to tell Sinead the whole time and it was pain. <laughs> I can't sing very well, if that wasn't obvious, but... I practiced that song a lot and I also sang it twice before she came up because I went up first and Sinead stayed down the bottom. She didn't still had no idea what was happening. I didn't hear anything. Sinead is completely clueless, clueless still and I actually practiced the song twice um, and they sucked 
very bad and I was very concerned that it was going to be horrible. It ended up being like half okay, so I'm... Fine. I thought it was romantic and I thought it was very good. You might have actually noticed I put the ring on the wrong finger. <laughs> I do not blame myself. It was me. For Sinead put her hand out yeah. and I just put it on. I couldn't wait any longer. All my life I wanted to get married but and find love. And I just said, put it on already. And I accidentally you, did the wrong finger. So, As you can see though, it is on the right finger now. And, and my ring, ring, my ring's here. It does go on my finger sometimes. Yes. I had no idea about Sinead. But we kissed for a very long time after she said yes to take the piss. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it was very beautiful. And it was. then Shanae screamed as loud as possible into the ocean. And then we were walking past people and I would tell, yell out, I'm engaged to random people walking past. It was a lot more... People, wasn't it? It's was like every person I saw. I yeah, so now you had to <laughs> felt the need to <laughs> tell everyone that she walked past that she was engaged, and everyone. you know, everyone. I think it's very reasonable because she was engaged. Yeah. In the show, Shanae says, "I make her brave," but the truth is, she makes me braver as well, and we both equally make each other brave. <laughs> um, being on the show was. Very daunting, and I wish there were things I could could have done better. I was very proud of season two, which we'll be talking about in another one. Um, thanks for watching. L like if you enjoyed, comment if you want, and subscribe if you watch to the end. <laughs> uh, see you later. See you later. <laughs>